Good morning, Mustangs. Today is Wednesday, April 9th, 2014. Please stand for the pledge. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Just a reminder that this Friday is the last day to nominate a student or faculty staff member for the Mustang Kindness Award for the month of April. Please turn your nominations into the front office, the box by Mrs. Drake's room, and the box in the library hallway. Thank you. Any student attending Pima Community College next year is invited to an orientation on April 11th, 9 to 11 a.m. Students must sign up in the counseling office by this Friday. See the counseling office for more details. The late registration deadline for summer school has be been extended to this Friday, April 11th. Summer school applications need to be turned in by this date so you do not get charged the late registration fee. Jocelyn's will be here during your lunch hour with graduation announcements on Friday. Please go by and pick them up. Juniors and seniors, prom is this weekend. Have you bought your ticket yet? You can still buy your ticket for $75 in the front office. There will be great food, a dessert bar, a candy bar, mimes, and a great DJ. Buy your tickets as soon as possible. There are still some local scholarships available in the counseling office. Make sure to check the deadlines. Many are due soon. And that's the news, Mustangs. Have a wicked Wednesday. Several months of what I can only describe as torture, I welcomed death. I wasn't suicidal like many of the PC patients are, but the plain fact was, I was done. Facing my own death brought an instant sense of clarity and purpose. If I was indeed going to die, I asked myself, what did I want to say before I went? It became very simple and very clear. I wanted to tell people what I had come to know. And what I had come to know was that the world I was living in was a lie, and the game I had won at, which I thought would help to heal the world, might very well be what was destroying it. <laughs> 